you know, it kind of came out of nowhere when Aquaman was coming out. Now, there were some people saying Aquaman was going to be a flop. There were people like me who said, I'm telling you, Aquaman's going to be a hit. But even people like me who were saying, this thing's going to make money, it's going to be a hit. But when somebody brought up the idea of it making a billion dollars, I was like, oh, 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 oh no, it ain't going to make a billion dollars. Let's not be silly, ladies and gentlemen. Let's not be silly. It's going to be a hit. It's going to make money. It's going to be great. Jason Momoa is the man, but it's not going to make a billion dollars. And lo and behold, the thing made like $1.1 billion, which is incredible. The first DCEU movie to crack a billion dollars. Uh, to this day, I mean, because Joker is not really part of the DCU. To this day, Aquaman stands as the only DCEU film to make a billion dollars. Uh, so obviously everybody knew that an Aquaman 2 was going to be coming forthwith. And we've been hearing talks about Aquaman 2. You know, we've been seeing Jason Momoa doing, you know, workouts to get ready for Aquaman 2. We've been seeing Amber Heard doing her workouts, getting ready for Aquaman 2. We've been hearing about all the other casts joining Aquaman 2. But we've never actually had a release date or at least a start of production date. But that has now changed. We do now have confirmation from Jason Momoa himself, that Aquaman 2 starts shooting pretty damn soon. Like, really damn soon. Like, six to seven weeks soon. I had heard six or seven weeks uh, a couple of days ago, and then Jason Momoa came out and said, yeah, we're going to start shooting in July, which is about six or seven weeks away. And that's what's coming. Now, this is interesting for a couple of reasons, but let's get to what Jason Momoa said. Uh, actually, we're reading here from the folks over at Screen Rant. But this is what Jason Momoa said. He said, after we um, after we ended the first one, I went with my writing partner and we dreamed up the second one. So, you know, Jason Momoa is actually saying he had a hand in the story of what we're going to get in Aquaman 2. Anyway, uh, after we ended the first one, I went with my writing partner and we dreamed up the second one and we went in and pitched the idea. The best thing I can give you is that I love it so much that I participated in the writing of it. And so we did the first treatment and then James and our original writer, David, uh, our original writer, David finished it off and all of our hearts are in it. Instead of just like getting a script and doing that, you are 100% encouraged by your director and co-writers. So that's exciting for me. And I'm excited to go over there. I leave in July and we start filming. So that comes to us from Jason Momoa himself couple of interesting things here. Number one, it's not the rarest thing in the world, especially when the star of a film and the director have a close relationship that the director will, will often give ear to what the star has to say. Now, listen, the stars, the actors in a movie should never have influence, in my opinion, should never have influence over which way the story goes. I mean, that they're there to be any more than the gaffer on a movie who is there contributing to the movie should have any say in which way the story goes. But that being said, if the director has a close trust built relationship with the, uh, if the, if the director has a trust build relationship with the actor, well then, you know, and, and you know, they know the actor is really invested and they know the actor has an idea. Then why not? You know, while you're sitting there, if James Wan is talking to Jason, Jason says, listen, I've actually got an idea for number two. If you'll hear it out. And James Wan says, sure, let's hear it. And then Momoa kind of spills out what it is he he was envisioning. Now, the key thing here is that Momoa didn't write the script, right? They came up with a story treatment, gave it to them, and then they went off and actually wrote out the script. But still, I think it's interesting that some of what we're going to actually see on screen in Aquaman 2 comes from Jason Momoa. Now, of course, you can't talk about the Aquaman 2 situation Without at least, and I hate doing it, but without at least mentioning up all the hubbub and kerfuffle over Amber Heard. Because, you know, there's a bunch, there's a group of people that want Amber Heard removed from the movie. Uh, that obviously isn't going to happen at this point, especially if this movie starts shooting in July. Uh, because Amber Heard continues to be public about her prep for the movie. They're only like just a little over, you know, six weeks away from actually starting to shoot this damn thing. And so I think it's pretty clear she's in there. Now, nobody should be surprised by that. Nobody should, should be surprised by this. That Amber Heard is going to be in Aquaman 2. Uh, number one, because the whole time 
Warner Brothers has had her back. Jace Momoa has been supportive. Zack Snyder has had her has been in her corner. Um, I mean, it just it shouldn't be a surprise to anybody that she is going to be there. Clearly, the artists involved and the studio itself have been behind her, so that wasn't really going to change. Not to mention James Wan wanted her in the sequel, so that was pretty much that. So that's kind of the other little side note here that's interesting, finding out that this movie starts shooting so soon, is that this pretty much confirms. Now, listen, last second things can happen. We could very well find out in, you know, two weeks from now that maybe Amber Heard gets removed. That's still a possibility. So let's let's not say it's taken out. But considering they are shooting this movie pretty damn soon, they're in final prep for it and everything, if they were going to remove Amber Heard from this, it would have happened by now. At least that's the way I look at it, is that it would have happened by now. So I'll be surprised at this point if anything happens with Amber Heard. I think she's she's stuck in there. Uh, I think she wants to be there. I think the filmmakers want her there. So I, I think that's pretty much that. Again, anything can happen in the next couple of weeks. But it seems like if they're this close to shooting, such a significant change like that probably would have been done already. Uh, and so there you have it. Listen. I really like that first Aquaman movie. I, I like. I don't like it quite as much as Robert Meyer Burnett did because he went bananas for it. But I really like this Aquaman movie. I love Jason Momoa. I cannot wait to see Aquaman 2. It's going to be exciting to see. Question is for you guys. What do you think about this? Jason Momoa come out and saying, hey, we start shooting this thing in like six, seven weeks. And I had a hand in the story. How do you guys feel about that? Jump on down to the comment section below and let us know your thoughts. Okay, guys.